Hey everyone, welcome back to the channel. In today's video, we're going to show you how to customize your footer widgets. Scrolling down our site here, you can see that we have our footer area here and we have some widgets. Let's go ahead and enter the WordPress customizer. And let's go ahead on the left sidebar here and click on footer. And you can see we have our elements here and then we can, oops, let's go ahead and take a look at it. And we can um, customize it here by moving it up a bit. This is widget area one, and you can see it moves up among our three rows here. And if we have our widget areas here, if we click on that, we can change it up from here. So let's say instead of an about us, we want to put something else from our um, block inserter here. We can browse all of them. You can see we have um, everything from um, stackable and blocks as well. So let's go ahead and change this one up to um, just a search bar. So let's drag and drop that here. And you can see we have our search bar here. And then we can simply delete these. Right. And we can also insert our social media icons here. And of course, we can customize these uh, any which way we want. Right. And from here, we can also change our horizontal alignment. You can see that it shrinks there, or it goes on the middle, or it goes on the right. We also have a vertical alignment, but that stays like that. And if you want it to be um, tablet or mobile responsive, you can change the options here as well. If we have it enabled, right, we can change whether or not it's on the left or the right if we're using desktop or mobile. We also have design over here. And we can change the font colors. There you go. And so on and so on. You can see it's red over here and it's kind of gray when you hover over it and it's blue. And then we can also put um, underlines if there are any links there. We can also change the margin spacing, right? And we can go ahead and publish this and check out our website. Alternatively, we can go onto our dashboard. We can hover over appearance and click on widgets if you didn't want to use the customizer. So we're here on the widget area of our dashboard. And you'll see here, once it loads in, we have our sidebar widgets here, and you see here, widget area one. And if you clicked on that, it's the same thing as a while ago. Let's wait for this to publish. Let's, let's refresh this page and wait for that to load up. And you can see that instead of about us, it now updated because we published it to our search and socials. But the difference between editing it from in here in our customizer and over here is that it gives us a bit more control. So whereas here we could see some options here, we can go ahead and click on our socials icon here. And you see here on the right pane, we have our um, icon colors, which we can change by default here. And then we can hover over it. It becomes pinkish white. Suppose I guess it doesn't preview, but we can also change our um, icons as well. So we can add an email, we can add um, a Discord link, right? Click plus, and then we can configure our socials here. We can also um, change uh, the visibility, but this is just an example. And we can also change up the settings here for open links in a new tab, set links to no follow, change up the icon size from here and so on and so forth. So we have a bit more control when we edit it from our widgets appearance tab here on our dashboard. And we can do the same thing with um, all of our other, other widgets. But to keep the video real short and simple, we'll update that, we'll save that, and we'll go ahead and enter our site once it's done saving. And now once we scroll down here to our footer area, we have our customized footer widget that we can customize further later on down the line and move it around our footer area. So there's how you customize your footer widgets on WordPress Bloxy. If you found this video helpful, please leave a like, comment, and subscribe to the channel as it really helps us out with the YouTube algorithm. Show this kind of video to other nerds like us. Thanks for watching and we'll see you on the next one.